It's the first part of that video, I was showing you how I was just making dashes back and forth and back and forth. Now I want to come across the H so that you can um, fill in the center. So now I have to change the direction of my stitch. So if I'm going to fill in the center, now I'm going to go vertically up and down to make my H. So it could be my initials, it could be a word, it could be a phrase. You could really, you know, if you're interested in doing this, it's the kind of thing that if you have enough yarn on hand, you can do a lot. You just want your dashes to line up right next to each other, like so. So that's the beginning of my H. I'll pause this. And now just to finish my video, this is what my H looks like. Now, in the future, if anyone is interested, there is a way to do your initials using chains that lock together. And sometimes for something like an O, or an S, it's easier to do that way. So that's something we'll revisit later. So that's how to do an initial. Nice work, guys.